resources, inspiring interviews, business practices, and practical advice to take your art career to the next level. Join Sergio Gomez in today's Artist Next Level and get ready to take control of your career. Well, hello, my Next Level friend. Welcome to a brand new episode of the Artist Next Level podcast. This is a special edition episode in which I am interviewing artists from around the world as they are stuck at home during the coronavirus lockdown. Today, I have with me all the way from Acapulco, Mexico, my good friend, Gabriel Sanchez Viveros. We're going to talk about an initiative that he is doing over on Instagram that's called Art in Isolation. Hi, Sergio. I'm doing fine. And you? Sorry, let me just remove this. I'm at home so I can do it. <laughs> exactly. Projects, I will let you know about it. I think, yes, we're a little bit, I think we're a little bit more than six feet away. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about it. <laughs> Last time I saw you was here in Chicago during one of the exhibitions that I curated and you were part of. And, um, you know, how much the world has changed in, you know, since that one visit to now, right? It's incredible. Yes, you bet. It's, it, it, it's, it has been uh, so many things. I mean, last year I, have, I was traveling and traveling and traveling. I mean, mm-hmm. and uh, uh, even I was in China. And mm-hmm. then uh, I was in Europe. And then one of the things that also in February of this year, I was in, 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 in Barcelona. Uh-huh. Because uh, supposed to be yesterday, I was opening an exhibition. Yeah. But uh, we just need to postpone. And that's it. Right, yeah, yeah, right. I, I, so that brings you back to Acapulco, Mexico. So tell me how things are in Mexico right now. Are you in full lockdown? Is it partial? You know, what's the situation there? Okay, you know, here, uh, well, all Mexico, we are in full lockdown. I mean, that, that's what they request mm-hmm. to us. But uh, there is a lot of people who, that it's, it's working and need to work. I mean, the, the, right. the doctors and the nurses, but uh, right. also it's a lot of people, supermarkets, that they need to be working. So the idea is just to keep locked as much people you can keep locked. Mm-hmm. It will be easy for the other people to be. So, mm-hmm. but uh, ec- economically talking, it has been very difficult, and right. it will come very, very hard for the absolutely, next, yeah, but all over the world. Exactly, yeah. At this point, it's a it's a world crisis, not just one place, uh, like you know, something that might be a hurricane or earthquake or something. Like that. Something that has come to affect everyone. There's been a lot of uh, initiatives because of the pandemic that have come around. Because of it. one of them is, for example, the Artist Support Pledge. You know, um, that I participated and others I have participated too. And, and you came up with your own idea also for an initiative that's called Art in Isolation or Art in Aislamiento in Spanish. Uh, tell me a little bit about how the idea came for that and um, what is art in isolation uh, that, uh, that you have started? Oh, okay. Let me, let me tell you. I mean, it, it has been very, very interesting. And, mm-hmm. uh, well, let me tell you first that yeah. uh, you have been an inspiration all the time since I oh, met thank you. you. <laughs> and you're working very hard and you're doing so many things. So uh, when we start with all of these issues here in Mexico, I say, well, what do we can do? I mean, as an artist, uh-huh. I, 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 can't, I, I postpone two ex- exhibitions. I have one right. in Madrid, and one in Barcelona, yes, mm-hmm. and one here in Mexico. And I need to, no cancel, but to postpone. Right. And right. That if this is happening to me now, what is happening to all the artists and uh, right. all the all the community. So um, I talked with uh, uh, three of my good friends and they assist me in so many things. Mm-hmm. And I told them that what we can do, what we can work. I, I want to show uh, some pictures. I want to show things that, that I have. And um, uh, my good friend, Christian, she starts saying, well, you know, you have a lot of pictures from before. So why we don't start working with them? Mm-hmm. And the idea pop out. Yes, like a popcorn, pop, 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 pop. Uh-huh. and we start doing this, the arte en aislamiento or art in isolation. And, and, and let me tell you a little bit about it. Yeah. It's a, it, it, it is an initiative I propose to go from virtual to perpetual, okay. uh, to the creation of networks uh, uh, of artists and creatives to share the work that they are doing in the difficult times that like, okay. the ones we're living now. So, mm-hmm. and uh, we create a, uh, a union of support uh, between artists, between uh, uh, creators, 
between um, um, how say followers mm -hmm. and uh, I don't know, it's that you know human beings. Right, yes, right. Uh, mm -hmm. Because what happened is that we we never thought we were going to get locked down in a house. I right. mean, like they were like a jail. Well, yes, but also it. I mean, it has the the, the good things that and the bad things. I mean, right. you you can realize how many things you have in your house that you don't need. <laughs> That's many, for sure. How many trash you have that you don't need? Yeah. And uh, and all the things that you have that you don't need anymore, you can share with people that probably they need. So right. you know, I think I think this this it has been very very, very impressive. But coming back to to, to your mm -hmm. question, so the, the initiative what it proposes uh, virtual exhibitions. Okay. Yes. So um, this period of social uh, isolation, um, we can be experiencing a different things. Uh, mm -hmm. The artists can show the pieces. The artists can show uh, what they're doing at home, and uh, to forget a little bit about all this bad information and all of this uh, boom that we have on, on on the media and on the TV and on the radio and the newspapers. Or magazines, and you know that that that, that create a, a, like a, 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 you become afraid of mm -hmm. what is going on because we don't know what's going on and what's going to happen for the future. So the idea is that uh, going into because all all the people is going to the to the uh, uh, Instagram and uh, Facebook and social media, but even so, you can find a lot of uh, fake news there and a lot, and mm -hmm. a lot like oh, be aware of them. no no. So what we <laughs> yeah. want. Like you have like a like a space of relax, like a space to say, well, thanks God. Oh well, look, look what this guy is doing. Oh, I'm doing this now, so I can share this. So the idea was to um, call artists to participate. In fact, you are one of the artists I call, and I'm just expecting that you 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 help us to put something there because yeah. you work amazing. But you have done, and I have seen that you were <laughs> giving some giveaway. But only from the USA, and the USA is actually, well, not in the USA. <laughs> yeah, the, the expensive to ship outside of the USA, right? <laughs> yeah. But someday I will have one of your pieces. So. <laughs> there you go. So, um, uh, I mean, uh, this is the idea. I mean, to, to create yeah. to create space in time and uh, things that you can see and you can enjoy. And I can show you the work I'm doing, and you can see the work I'm doing. Mm -hmm. And it can help you or can help me as an inspiration, but at the same time, but probably you know someone who was interesting in, but, oh, you know, uh, this guy is doing uh, big format pieces, or this guy is doing photography, or in, uh, do intervention in photography. So, you know, it's like create a network of, mm -hmm. in one way, to, to relax yourself and, and, mm -hmm. and know about the other, but also to, to, mm -hmm. to help people probably to interact and right. help. On, on sales in the future yeah. yeah so it is kind of a it celebrates the work that is being done in isolation right now uh, by artists from all over the place and is it um, a specific to a geographic area or is it open to artists anywhere that they might want to participate how, how no, does it, the actual it, work sure no it's open all all, all the world so we, 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 let me tell you a little bit about some i have some uh, i make some notes on uh -huh. this so uh, uh, now we have already like 63 works, yeah, that they have been uh, uh, putting on on okay. the, the the page. Uh, we have almost invited through my 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 um, Instagram uh, account. Mm -hmm. uh, I have invited 103 people now, artists. Great. Right. Yeah, mm -hmm. and all of these artists already invite or or uh, how you said this is not by they nominate nominate the, yeah. nominate. 73 people more so oh, we're, we're, like, we're growing and growing uh -huh. and growing and people have been putting one picture or two pictures of their works so um what they have been most uh, showing is photography or paint but we have a couple of uh, of uh, sculptures and mm -hmm. also uh, ceramic so mm -hmm. it is interesting because it, 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 it it's popping out and right. and um it, because it was done in the beginning of the, the lockdown, mm -hmm. uh, it has been taking um, attention from the newspapers mm, and also from the government in Mexico, because I'm one yeah. in one of the publications of the government. Like, right. Gabriel Sanchez is doing art in isolation. They're like, wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, I'm happy because of this, uh, mm -hmm. because uh, people is paying attention of, of the things. And uh, 
and 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 people is moving their their thoughts of uh, uh, something bad to mm-hmm. something creative, and this is what right. we need to do. Right. So this is what you are doing with, with all of this uh, uh, mm-hmm. uh, conversation and chats. Because when I, you, I, I see them, you're like, wow, my goodness, this guy is doing a lot. And then you see the artists, how they are locked down and they're mm-hmm. showing what they're doing. Yeah. Yes. So, um, well, Great. I don't know if I answer, the, answer your question. Because that is perfect. And I think maybe some of the friends who are watching right now, maybe say, so how, do, how can I participate or how can I submit something? What is the process if, uh, if an artist wants to submit something that they have been doing right now in isolation for the project that you have? Yes. So what I, I invite all the all the all the uh, the artists or the creatives to go to uh, uh, at arte dot n dot aislamiento. Yes. Or probably they can contact me through my uh, Instagram, which is at g s v dot artist. So this is the way. So if, if, if they contact us on this way, they can do it. Um, um, because we have been uh, choosing some people of my, my um, the people that are in my pages, or my, my friend pages, and then we can uh, nominating or inviting them to do it. So this is, this is a way to Excellent. Well, thank you so much, uh, Gabriel. We are running out of time. You know, uh, time goes by so fast. So what can, or, or you already shared, uh, where can the friends find the Art in Isolation page? And we have it right here under the video. And also, where can they find you? Uh, how about just in two minutes, really quickly, you as an artist, what have you been uh, working on lately? Lately, what I have been working uh, uh, beside the, the Art in Isolation is the uh, uh, Flora Soul collection, which mm-hmm. is uh, what I'm doing. I have drying all of the things, all, all of the things you have seen here yeah. on the back. Uh, you know these art already are pieces. And I, I'm keep working on this. This is the main issue that I'm working now. Okay. In fact, the, the exhibition for Barcelona, it's, a, it's Ferdinand. If it's the name of the exhibition, you know, okay. well, of this book. And, uh, and I have a bull from one of the collections. Yes, from the, the, <laughs> the El Origen. And also I have uh, art pieces from Roth and also art pieces from Flora Soul. Mm. And because I like the idea, I'm working on a bigger exhibition with it, okay. using flowers, using blooms, using the bull, and well, whatever. So this is what I'm working. Um, if uh, if uh, people wants to visit my webpage, they will see more things. It's my webpage, uh, www.gabrielsanchezviveros, all together, mm-hmm. .com. So Excellent. That's, that's a way. And Sergio, well, thank you so much for having me here please regards to janina and your kids absolutely and, and your dog that's up here <laughs> everywhere <laughs> yeah, absolutely thank you so much uh, gabriel for your time for joining us today uh, hopefully we can see each other again either in mexico or here in chicago for another good pizza again uh, or uh, you know at some other point uh, but uh, wishing you uh, uh, also the best and health for the future congratulations on the project Wishing you great success on that and all the artists participating. And thank you, my friends, for watching today. Please, if you like this conversation with my friend Gabriel, follow uh, him on Instagram, hit up uh, his uh, Instagram page as well. Uh, Let me know how you like it. Please share it with your friends. So Gabriel and I will be really happy and thankful for that as well. Have a great day. Goodbye. Check out our website at www.theartistnextlevel.com where you will find our podcast library, learn about our upcoming webinars, find resources relevant to your career, and much more. Thanks for listening to today's podcast, and we'll see you at the next level.